Hello, my name is Chris Roselle. I'm a graduate student in civil and environmental engineering at Georgia Tech. I study how to build water systems in developing countries. I have a master's of public health and a master's of nutrition. I have worked in over 20 low-income countries of Africa, Asia, and the Americas. Today, 700 million people still lack water services and 2.5 billion don't have sanitation. What happens without water and sanitation? Typically, one out of every four babies dies in his or her first year of life. Young children have diarrhea about every six weeks, risking their lives, costing their families money for health care, and requiring that someone stay at home to nurse them. Often, young girls are taken out of school to carry water. People get sick with worms, diarrhea, water-related blindness, and severe fevers. Families grow less food and raise fewer animals. Even the economy suffers because many businesses depend on water. Here you see a common sight from communities without water services. A primary school age girl carrying water rather than attending school. Everyone is infected by nutrient consuming worms and becomes dehydrated due to diarrhea. Blindness is more common. Trachoma happens when children don't have water to wash their faces. River blindness is common where people are bitten by infected flies that breed in contaminated water. If civil engineering does not remove contaminated pools of water, malaria, sleeping sickness, and yellow fever are caused by mosquitoes, debilitating and killing the people. Diseases you don't want to imagine, like guinea worm and cystosomiasis, are common. Hunger is more common because water is necessary for growing food and raising animals. Civil and environmental engineering solutions can be simple, like this ventilated improved pit latrine and this hand pump. Or they may be more complex, like the gravity flow systems most of, most of us have with flush toilets, sinks, and faucets throughout our homes and communities. 700 million people today in 2014 who lack potable water and the 2.5 billion who still lack sanitary facilities kills more people every day than 9-11. Civil and Environmental Engineering's water and sanitation services save lives, make our lives easier, allow us to maintain everything clean, and empower our agriculture and our businesses to produce more.